Hello there, I'm Jonathan, and today I'm gonna to very quickly show you, step by step, how to connect your Lightner Premium Plus wireless headset to your Apple computer. All right, when setting up your Lightner Premium Plus with a Mac, the first thing we'll need to do is get all the pieces together. In this case, I've got my Premium Plus wireless headset connected to power, as you can see from the blue focus light. You'll want the USB cord that comes with that Premium Plus headset and you'll want your Mac, of course. Now, if you're using a modern Mac that has a USB-C port like mine, you're also gonna want a USB-C adapter that you can use with this USB cord. So you can use any USB-C from USB adapter that you have on hand. Okay, the Lightner end of things is super easy peasy. First, take the Lightner headset off the base, set it to the side out of your way, and then I like to make sure that the charging base is already set to computer mode, before we then turn around to the back of the base and find the USB-C port on the left side of the back there. And then take your USB cord that came with the Lightner and find the USB-C end of that cord and plug that in right here. Next, go ahead and put your headset back on the base and head over to the computer end of things and we'll plug in there. Okay, continuing with these super easy steps here, we're gonna then go over to our Apple computer if it's a laptop, open it up. If it's a desktop, make sure it's powered on. And then get the USB cord that came with your Lightner. If you need a USB-C adapter, get that, connect it to your USB cord, and then plug that into an available USB-C port on the Mac. Then we're gonna go into the settings in the computer to make sure we're rocking and rolling. Okay, when you head into your Apple computer, first thing you're going to do is go to the Apple icon in the upper left-hand corner of the screen. Click there, and then look for System Preferences. Click System Preferences. You'll get a new window that pops up, and we're looking for the sound icon. There's a little speaker here. Open that up, and it's going to take us either to output or input first. For me, it landed in output. You want to make sure that this is set to the Lightner headset. Then come up to input, click there, Make sure that is also set to Lightner headset. And there you go. There you have it. You're now ready to rock and roll with that Lightner headset and your Apple computer. But of course, if you have any other questions or you need any other help at all, always feel free to give us a call at 1-800-HEADSETS, where any one of our headset advisors would be more than happy to help you. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.